All right, hey, Shalom Wong. We'll start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakak Kadash. A double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. And salutations to the hopeful elect out here pushing the word of truth and sincerity, Shalom Wong. Uh, today, it's going to be a lesson uh, focused around uh, long suffering, man. You know, long suffering, that's uh, one of the fruits of the Spirit. And you know, that's a, a very. A very important trait to have in this truth, man. You know, because you know, it just by starting out by saying that, you know, our people in general are very impatient, man. You know, e even we get impatient, and there's there's certain acts of patience that we need to um, improve on. But you know, our people in general, they 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 want they want things when they when they want it, and they want um you know it's instant gratification. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but you know that that's that's something that the Lord uh, had, had put on us, man. Because really, um, long suffering. You know, I, I'm about to pull it up on my computer. You know, the computer was acting funny, but now it's working now. Shit, let me go ahead and just grab it now for you, brothers. Just bear with me one second. Now that I got it up and running, let's go ahead and get this definition for y'all. Just bear with me, brothers. I'll wait for this to load so we can pull out some edification on some words real quick. But yeah, man. Like I said, our people, they don't know. They don't like to wait. They don't like to, uh, you know. Because hey, they, they, the the saying goes, "Good things go to them that wait." You know, long suffering meaning. Right, long suffering, having or showing patience in spite of troubles, especially those caused by other people. You know, hey, and uh. That, 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 that that's that's basically the life that that we have to deal with you know on this side man is is, is is dealing with troubles man dealing dealing with things that may arise man dealing with um you know you got your women you got finances you got jobs you know you have you have to deal with yourself man you know there there's certain things that even yourself you know like going into like mentally man you know you you have to still show patience in spite of that and, and, and a, a good way to um to really in, in, endure those things is is remember the promises that Yahweh Bashem Yahshai has told us, man. You know, remember that the work that we are not in that we are doing is not in vain, man. You know, remember, you know what 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 the end goal is here, man. Because you know, I, I haven't uh you know been in the truth so long to say to give you examples, but um you know the scriptures say woe to those who have lost patience. And let me go ahead and get that. Uh, I have it in my notes written down. Just want to make sure I get the right scriptures. Right, this is. Let me jump to Sirach on here. Just bear with me, brothers. We're gonna read. Uh, be going reading through the Sirach, the the check it, the second chapter. You know, or uh, Ecclesiasticus. You know. Right. Man, we just gonna Man, most most brothers know this, so we just gonna uh let's just let's start from the top, man. You know, this is uh Sirach chapter two verse one. It says, My son, if thou come to serve the Lord, prepare thy soul for temptation. Set thy heart aright and constantly endure and make not haste in the time of trouble. Hey, and and the definition of long suffering is, is maintaining patience through 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 trouble, man, you know. It says, "Cleave unto him and depart not away, that thou mayest be increased at thy last end." And and that's and that's keeping your eye on the prize, man. You know that's that that's maintaining you 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 uh you set goals, man. Maintaining you 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 keep that vision of, of the kingdom, man. Keep that vision of salvation. Keep the vision of deliverance. 
you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. Uh, Lord willing, we, we be of those men, you know. It says, cleave unto him and depart not away that thou mayest be creased at the last end. Whatso better, whatsoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully and be patient when thou art changed to a low state. Be patient, man. Man, let, let's just get that definition for patient. Just for you, for you brothers, for some edification. Because, hey, we all know what it means, but let's get some synonyms. You know, because it really means to suffer. You know, able to accept or tolerate delays, problems, or suffering without becoming annoyed or anxious, man. Without becoming annoyed or anxious. You know, that, that's the key, man. That's basically like trying to control your spirit, man. Basically keeping that keeping that sound mind that Yahweh Bashim Yahshah had gave us, man. You know, uh, synonyms, forbearing, uncomplaining, tolerant, long-suffering, resign. Let's get some more. Uh, tranquil, un unexcitable, accommodating, understanding, man. Understanding, man. You know, we, we, we're going to catch hell. We're going to catch affliction, man. You know, because, you know, if it was up for us, it was up to us. Shit, what's today? Tuesday, you know, we'll have Jacob Trouble tonight. The chip tomorrow. World War Three by Friday. We'll be in the kingdom by Saturday, man. You know, but that that that's that's it feels up to us, man. But you know, we're we're on Yahweh Bashim Yahushua's time frame, man. We're we're on we're on his schedule, man. And and that's and that's a real a real humbling thing to have, man. When uh when you realize that you're not in control, you know. Let's continue in this rock too. It says, "For gold is tried in the fire, and acceptable men in the furnace of adversity." Believe in him, and he will help thee. Set thy way aright, and trust in him. Ye that fear the Lord, wait for his mercy, and go not aside, lest ye fall. Ye that fear the Lord, believe in him, and he shall reward, and your reward shall not fail. Ye that fear the Lord, hope for good and for everlasting joy and mercy, man. You know, so you always have to, you know, trust in the Lord. You know, always, always, uh... Have that reminder that um, he's going to get you out of whatever, man. But hey, we 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 are, you know, currently the the way things are set up, man. We we're we're, we're here to, you know, basically take low level L's, man. Low level because th this shit is is really nothing, man. You know, but the Lord, you know, the Lord gives us wins, you know. But we 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 we're, we're here to just to just take the low, man. But let me jump to to what I want to get. This is uh. Sirach chapter 2 verse 14 it says woe unto you that have lost patience and what will you do when the Lord shall visit you man because you 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 weren't waiting on the Lord you, you threw off uh what what the Lord was trying to accomplish man you know because he's really trying to just build us up you know he, he's trying to you know give us give us some things to grow through the spirit man give us some situations give us some understanding how it says you know but let's um let me get this Isaiah I'm going to jump to Isaiah 59 real quick for you, brothers. <coughs> okay. This is Isaiah chapter 59. And it says, um, verse 15. It says, Yea, truth faileth. And he that departed from evil, making himself a prey, and the Lord saw it, and it displeased him that there was no judgment. Right. So when 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 we don't do the worldly things that these niggas do, man, you know, when 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 we not uh, out here committing adultery, when we not eating pork, man, we we're set up as a prey, man. You know, we're looked at as upon targets. We looked at as, as weird, man. But hey, that's that that's the long suffering of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua, man. Hey, because even Yahweh Shai wants to come back and uh, get his hands dirty, get get he, get his hands on you two third niggas, get his hands on you Edomites, man. But that's that that's long suffering on, on his part, man. You know, because it said the day of the Lord burneth in in, in, in his heart, basically, man. And, and, he, and he's 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 waiting for that, just 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 as much as we're waiting for him to come back, man. Hey, and <laughs> that like I said, that's that that's the humbling experience. About being in the truth is knowing that you're not going according to your will. I mean, we never were, and we're not going into according to our time frame, man. You know, thing, things is working how the Lord wants it to work. Um, this is going to be my last scripture. 
I'm going to jump to Numbers chapter 14. Just bear it with me. Right. Numbers 14 and 18, it says, The Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yahshai, is long suffering and of great mercy, forgiving iniquity and transgression. You know, that, that's the Israelites, man. You know, if, if if you repent, the Lord the Lord will forgive iniquity and transgression, man. And by no means clearing the guilty. Hey, and you you so-called Red Hebrew Edomites, y'all niggas is guilty, man. The, the you Israelites that don't repent, y'all niggas is guilty, man. And it says, by no means clearing the guilty, visiting the iniquity of the fathers upon upon, uh, upon the children unto the third and fourth generation, man. Hey, in the times that we live in now, man, judgment is just about to start rolling, man. Judgment is about to start rolling, man. You know, because it is, it, we, man, you, y'all know what the prophets are at, man. Y'all know where to find the truth. Y'all, y'all, y'all have access to the name of the Lord. Y'all have access to the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of Yahweh by Shimei Shah, man. But hey, you, you, you people love it in America, man. But hey. You know, this was just a video for you, brothers, just to, uh, you know, give y'all some cur um, encouragement, man, just to, to keep, continue to be long-suffering, man, because, hey, I, I you know, I want to make it out of here. All, all y'all brothers want to make it out of here, man. Yahweh Shai wants to come back, man. But like I said in the video, uh, you know, we're really on Yahweh Bashim Yahshai's time frame, man. So, you know, we just have to uh, stay ready so you ain't have to get ready. You know, <laughs> that's basically what it is, man. Hey, but with that, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakak, Radash. Hey, double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders, uh, salutations to the hopeful elect. Shalom.